Story time with Fergie and friends. I, I feel so lucky to, to, to love Beatrice Blue and I love uh, Once Upon a Time, Once Upon a Unicorn Horn and I love uh, the fact that Beatrice and uh, Quarto Books are so generously kind to let us read this book. So um, Beatrice, uh, thank you, thank you so much. I, I know you may, everyone may have heard it, but it's uh, it's number one at Waterstones and uh, I, I'm just thrilled to read it because I think it's a very, very special book. This uh, this book is also read for uh, my goddaughter, little Vivi, and uh, for little Luna, because uh, I think little Luna is her, is her little half, it's little sister, little sister. So Vivi, Luna, and to mummy Tamara, and to, and to everybody that loves unicorns. Once upon a magic forest, there was a little girl called June. <gasps> June knew the woods were full of treasures waiting to be discovered. She loved to climb through the tallest trees to find castles and peer through the bushes to find magic wands. <gasps> then one day, June found the greatest treasure of all. <gasps> tiny, tiny, magic horses learning to fly. Hmm. She couldn't believe it. I'm terribly sorry, I couldn't find any horses flying today. So I'm going to use this little white horse. Zoom! Now come on, white horse, you can play in a minute. <gasps> How incredible is that? They shook their soft fur. They fluttered their sparkly tails <gasps> and whizzed into the air, whizz, like that. But there was one little horse that wasn't flying and he looked very sad. Oh, are you okay, little horsey? June asked. Can't you fly? He shook his head. No, I, I can help you, said June. We, we just have to make your fur shake and, and your tail flutter. Yes. So they tried rolling and jumping and running really, really fast. Hmm. But nothing, nothing happened. Oh dear. I guess we'll have to use magic, said June. She rummaged through her box of treasures until she found her most powerful, powerful of magic wands. June swooshed a big swoosh and wished a big wish. Yes, but it still didn't work. The little horse was sadder than ever, and so was June. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh. Poor little horse, you sit there, little horse. As soon as she got home, mum and dad could tell something was very wrong. Not even her favorite dinner could make her smile. June told them all about the tiny horse. I, I tried to help, but my magic wand didn't work, she said. I think it's broken. Oh, no, don't worry, mum and dad said. We can fix it together. Yes, well done, mum and dad, yes. How do we fix my wand, said June. Let's start by trying to cheer up your friend. Yes, that's a good idea, said mum. Tomorrow, we'll think of all the things that a little horse might like, said dad, clever dad. The next morning, everyone thought hard. Something sweet, said June. Mm, something happy, said dad. Mm, what about something to share, said mum. There they all are, getting ready. Oh, I say blow, blow joy bubbles, don't you? Should we have a little, little bit of a joy bubble moment? Okay, let's blow joy bubbles. There we are, that's magic. Come on, little horsey, right? I know, said June, let's give him an ice cream. Yes, great idea. Just before she left, mum and dad whispered a magic formula to make sure the ice cream tasted super sweet. Psh, psh, psh. June couldn't wait to cheer up her friend. She ran as fast as she could, but it was a little too fast. She tripped, then the ice cream slipped out of her hand and, oh no, June, smush, splat. Oh no, it was a disaster. No, no, look. Splish, splosh, splash. Oh, oh no, smush. And then June saw that the little horse liked his new horn very much. After all, it was perfectly delicious. He smiled and then he laughed. Then he shook his soft fur and fluttered his sparkly tail. How good is that? Oh my goodness. And it worked. It was the happiest day ever, ever since magic horses have been called unicorns. For they all wear horns to remember the day when a little girl was a good, good friend. June often wears hers too. And she never forgets the magic formula. My magic is deep inside. 
and I don't need a wand to fly. Well done. Thank you. And well done, June. You can find the magic inside of you too. Thank you. With Fergie and friends. With Fergie and friends.